On this episode, we do a meet recap of the 4 a.m. crew, but specifically Trayvon Deer put up some big numbers, Danny. Yeah, Deer almost swept the board, and he's about to be elite. Yeah. I think the haters are going to hate this podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Trey's undercover jacked, but now he is fucking jacked, and you at home will know how jacked he is. Hey, you know what he just proved? The guy at the track that's skipping the lunges in between, quit fucking skipping the lunges. Trey's stronger than you. <laughs> Let's go to the episode. <laughs> Roundtable podcast. I'm your boy Corey G at Small Arms, Danny at Trey Speed, and the graphic gangster himself, Cole Susak. Brought to you by MaxSupperMuscle.com. What's up, fellas? I feel like we ain't been on the mic in a sec. What's up, sub? Yeah, it's been a minute. Yeah, been scattered a bit. Yeah. yeah, yeah, right. Busy. Uh, Cole, fresh cut. Yeah, looking good, kid. Good, yeah. Uh, Danny got a new crib. It's wet. What? What? Yeah. Yeah. That's actually, big time. Actually wet. Yeah. Okay, it's actually wet. Yeah. Trayvon did his first powerlifting meet. Wang yeah. out. Okay, good, good response, Trey. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what I like is that the topic of debate today is going to be Trey's first powerlifting meet because I think there's going to be a lot of good perspective. He's been capturing all of this for years now, but then being inside of it, we already know he's Trey Speed. We already know he's yeah. a great athlete, but we haven't got to see it on display, and it was fun to watch it. So, Trayvon, <sighs> tell me why you wanted to do it. Uh, you hadn't been training more than a couple of days a week, but mostly lunging for the last couple of years. So it's like, did, were you, was it just time for a challenge? Like, give me, give me some background. Um, honestly, like Tyler Galbraith convinced me because we, me and him trained together on Saturdays, mm -hmm. but like, yeah, I don't know. It just was like a long, it was a long time until like I had, um, like something like athletically, like that was competitive. So yeah. I just wanted to like, you know, hop back in and see how it would go and everything. But like, yeah, the training up to it was, uh lackluster there was like <laughs> people no, are gonna be haters after yeah. they hear there what was, you did too. there was like <laughs> essentially no training up to it's like really like maybe it, five yeah. weeks six weeks other than saturdays yeah and i benched probably like five times <laughs> like i never people like, be like fuck yeah. you trey trey's yeah. not fond of the upper body <laughs> uh, yeah so like i mean i like barely so i mean that, like that was like super so like what i thought was like super cool about it was like the like the like the lunges like it was it. like a testament of the lunges like I really think because like like I said like back to it, like I don't really train so like to not really like be squatting or deadlifting but to put up those numbers huge. I think is like a yeah. huge testament of the lunges the consistency of the lunges this entire time and I would argue the upper body's there I mean he tagged Vogue yeah. on Twitter or something the other day right did you yeah I was trying to get some engagement yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like some like ripped like you know he's like in the light and he's like tagging the magazines i'm like i see you trey i mean he is a yeah. fucking male model by yeah. farming yeah, yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> trey trey for the millions listening what were your numbers um squat or squatted four it was like 452 mm -hmm. benched, just wrote it on the board yep. yeah bench 226 and then deadlifted 480 that's, yeah, that's fire, and and that's at that's in the one forty eight class. One forty eight, yeah. So yeah. both my squat and my deadlift were like three x body weight, which is like <laughs> kind of wild. Yeah, it's yeah. also what's super interesting too is like um, I'm a lot stronger than I was in height, like and then in high school, yeah. Even, because like in high in high school, I only ever deadlifted like four like four fifty maybe or something mm -hmm. like that, and it was like a grinder though. Yeah, and then in high school, I squatted like four. 35 or four. That was training all the time too. And that was like training like, yeah, like seven. Were you around the same body weight? Like, were you, I was heavier actually. Oh really? Yeah. I was like, probably like five, like five. Like I was like, like in high school, I like walked around at like 160. Yeah. yeah. So like I was like a little bit, a little bit heavier yeah. even. Well, I'm probably not training as often is probably why you're a little lighter and yeah. because you're doing mostly just conditioning stuff yeah, still. Yeah, yeah. I think it was a fucking, yeah. I think there, I was going to tell the story of like, so on his first squad, well, first off, Big Mike's the first on the whole yeah. meet, right? Yeah. <laughs> Shout out Big Mike. Big Mike's a dog. <laughs> so Big Mike has Tyler Olds' old wraps. Wraps himself. <laughs> I walk in a little bit late. I just came down for squats or whatever. I walk in and Mike's on the platform, basically. He walks up and I'm like, I'll call you, Mike. I got this. And one of his wraps fall off. <laughs> Does he <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Thing? yeah, so he gets up under the bar. Yeah, the entire, the entire thing goes, like, gets and falls off. So I'm like... In the chaos yeah, sucks. So the fucking uh, the judge looks at me because they most of them know me from the last yeah, yeah, couple yeah. meets, right? And go, and I'm like, dude, I don't know, just fucking go. So I'm like, Mike, so he misses it, and I'm like, fuck. And then Trey's maybe I don't know, you know, a few a few away or whatever. Well, I wrap Trey the same way as I wrap any of us, right? Yeah, Which yeah. is like pretty tight around the joint. 
Well, Trey doesn't tell me he likes it wider because he probably just he's already thinking about the moment anyway, right? Yeah, yeah. So we get up there and we fucking miss it. Yeah. And it wasn't even close, was it, Trey? No. T- t- tell me what it felt like. Yeah. The yeah my my first two as- attempts on squat like felt like the worst squat. <laughs> like it felt. Like, <laughs> Trey wreck. <laughs> <laughs> foot's cramping. I literally felt. It literally felt like I like never squat. Squatting. Like I never squatted before. Literally. Like. The, let me ask you this. So, so Trey, bad. You haven't been. First off, I forgot it was his first meet. So I'm not because Trey's a gamer. I'm not yeah, even yeah. thinking we're in front of the lights all the time. I'm not even thinking like, wait a second, this could be slightly affecting him. He's never done it before. There's a crowd of people. The lights are on him. He's squatting, and you opened up pretty heavy for that mm-hmm. body weight. So it's like, was there other factors that you were you nervous actually, Trey, a little bit? No, I wasn't nervous. Honestly, honestly, like I, my, I had just a terrible warm up. Got it. Like I felt like. Uh, I, I felt like I won, like I started warming up too late mm. and mm. then since I started warming up too late, I felt like rushed. And so I didn't get to do like some of the, th- I didn't get to do like some of the, like, like the exercises that I would typically get to do. Gotcha. Yeah. And so like basically then since I felt, so and then like felt rushed. So, and then like, I'm trying to keep up though on squat cause everyone's warming up. Cause like there's, you know what I mean? There's cause like, I didn't, cause like, I didn't want to like hold people up on squat because mm. like you're, cause like when you're warming up in there, obviously like you're squatting with people that you don't typically squat with. For sure. So I don't want to be the, it's dot. always a pain in the yeah. ass. Yeah. So that's, I don't want to be like the annoying ass dude. That's like, actually I still need like one. Plate or that's, yeah. <laughs> that's always like one of the sneakiest, like trickiest things the is, meat. is the warm up for squats at a meet. Just oh, yeah. figuring out how the whole system works. Cause yeah, then you have a bunch of people who some of them don't even know what the fuck's going on or how to use yeah. a monolift. Or they think you it. don't know what's going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then, like, so that's, like, a whole thing. Yeah, so. just so, like, my, like, whole, like, warm-up, like, felt like a shit show. I probably would have, if you would have asked me for your openers, I probably would have opened you up lighter. Just because yeah. you never done it before. You know what I mean? Because if you would have took 405, even if we would have shit showed the rap, you still would have smoked it. Yeah. And then it's a different. So then, I wrap them better, but this motherfucker, I'm counting three, two. He doesn't wait for one, he just goes up. So then yeah. they red light them. So then all of a sudden I'm like, we're over fucking two. Yeah. And then this is my favorite part. I'm like, fucking, I, I walk over <laughs> to him. Ian, here's on top of it. Cause I've been in this position so many yeah. times. I'm like, oh, this is all right. We're going to see what Trey got today. Yeah. And so what's funny is I walk over and they keep switching the fucking order. So I think he's five out and yeah. all of a sudden cams before him and they pop the card right. And I'm like, fuck Trey, we, we got to go now. So it's like, so then I, I felt like I got what he needed rap wise and I was rapping the fucking as tight and as fast as I could. And I said, I'm not fucking counting. Just fucking squat it yeah. because yeah. Well, you, you basically got, you're out of the meat if you don't Fuck fucking yeah. make this. And then the lady. Trey needs this to stay in the meat. <laughs> yeah. as, he, as he's walking up. I fucking love that. Because you're like, fuck off. You know what I mean? Like, of course yeah. I know I don't want to fucking, fucking bomb lady, out. Yeah. yeah so yeah. anyway. And then the third one, they like smoked. Smoked it. it. Yeah. yeah like just fucking what, what, what was like going on squat. through your head before the third squat? Because the one time I I was dealing with this, I thought I was fucked. <laughs> yeah. I straight up thought I was fucked. <laughs> yeah. I was just like, yeah. Honestly, I just knew. Honestly, like, I just, like, going into the third squat, like, I knew what I needed to do because, like, like even like right after I took like the first two attempts, like I already knew like what was wrong on those attempts. Yep. So I just knew like I by the third attempt, like I knew I just needed like you actually squat. had more of a comfort. You just got yeah, fucking squat I just got it. more comfortable. Yeah, like I just knew I just needed to squat it because like the also like the first attempt, like I took it too slow. Like I already mm-hmm. know, like I like took it too slow, and yeah, it was just I it was a knew. shit show the first two. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, and that's why like when I walked over, I kind of like he's obviously super focused. I kind of laughed and was like. I'm just going to wrap the absolute shit out of you and just fucking squat the bar. Yeah. <laughs> I know you can make this. But when I was up against that, the the main time I was up against it, when I squatted 699.9, which is so fucking stupid. But I squatted that. And I remember grabbing the biggest dude standing close to the rack. And I just said, because they kept calling me on depth. I kept going up in weight, though, because I knew I could squat more. And I go, I'm just going to fucking drop in there and then grind the fuck out of this. So you just catch me. <laughs> And he's like, all right, let's fucking go. (laughs) I felt like in those moments, sometimes if I kind of take it and it's like I'm throwing it out the fucking window, I feel like I perform better because I'm like, well, I'm just up against it right now. But the sense of relief after you made that squat, I could see it on you. And you're like, okay. (laughs) 
continue. So. Yeah. yeah, and then bench, um, like on bench, I literally just opened at like 185 and just smoked all through my benches. So mm-hmm. I was like, what, what was the highest bench you took in training? Like probably 225. 225. Yeah, I pop like uh like one like Tuesday or like Thursday morning. I think I like just like literally just paused 225 just to see if I could do it. And I, yeah. could, <laughs> and, I, could, and, I and I could do it, and I was like, all right, I think that's what I want to finish at. It's nice. me. Yeah. So did you go. 185, 205, 225? Yeah. Yeah, smart. Yeah, and then that was super simple. And then what was your three deadlifts? Uh, f- <laughs> or no, you did two deadlifts. Yeah, I opened at 405 and, like, absolutely smoked it. Like, yeah. la- like Larry was like, I thought you were going to power cling it. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> – that Larry Pacifico yeah. said that. That's kind of epic. <laughs> and then and then after 405, I jumped to 480. Fuck yeah. Because well, – Because that's board number. Yeah. And and also because then I knew I would have two tries at it. Mm-hmm. And honestly, too, like whenever I deadlift, um, I don't like to take four fifty. Like I don't like to take four and a quarter. Yeah, yeah. Like I think like I my body feels better if I go like from just four to five plates usually. Yeah, I mean fuck it. So I didn't. Yeah, think, Danny, that's, that's get your, your fucking your life leg, together. That's your language right there. Get your fucking yeah. life together, so just, Danny. <laughs> yeah, so I just went from four oh five to like fuck four to like four eighty, <laughs> and then yeah. like four eighty flew. Like four eighty yeah. felt like really good. And then, it was real fast off the fucking ground. Yeah, and then I jumped to like five. It was like five oh one or five oh two or something like that. And it it like flew off the ground like how four eighty did. Yeah. And then like I got stuck in the knees. And then like mm. honest to be completely honest, it was just the end of the meet. I was like, you're just done. It's not worth it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it's just, yeah. like I knew I knew if I set the bar down, then like it's over and like yeah. cool. <laughs> yeah. I couldn't believe how fast he got to his fucking knee. I mean, like it looked like it was in fast forward. He's a tray second. speed. Yeah, he, it's facts. <laughs> uh, and then uh, felt awesome writing Dier on the board in yes. three spots today, right? So yeah. he almost did the clean sweep. He just what, needs to grab the bench next. Was there a conversation about writing Trayvon up there? Well, I asked first him. Name? Well, yeah. <laughs> what I asked him was, is there Alfred or Dier? Yeah. Because everyone's last name's up there. Yeah. So I was like, I was kind of, if pe- if we wrote Alfred, I think people would be like, who the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> Probably a lot of people yeah. don't even know it's his last name. Yeah. So, I, I mean, I thought Dier was the right point. A lot of people think Dier's my last name. No, I know. And it's it's like your stage name. I mean, you're fucking stage. famous, yeah. pretty. I mean, come on, motherfucker. Like, Dier his needs to go. Name. Yeah, <laughs> you know. So, and I told him I felt like I was wiping off one son and putting a do- another son on there today. Yeah. Like, it felt, I'm, I'm excited because you represent that weight class as a great athlete. And I think you can take the 250 and I think you can just continue to push those numbers up. So somebody's going to have to be really about it to take those. I believe AG possesses the ability eventually as he gets older to squat between 450 and 500. But as you continue to grow a little bit, it's going to be, it's, he, he, it just depends on if he wants to, but that at least now is up there. So it's going to have him thinking about it. And that's what I want. Every time I, every time I see him, he always jokes me about it. Oh yeah. Yeah. (laughs) Well, he uh, he took a picture on his Snapchat yesterday. I go, you better take a picture. I'm wiping it off tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> but I said, honestly, though, I said, AG, like, that's a huge accomplishment. To have your name on that board, whether it's for a day yeah. or for years, it's a huge accomplishment because there are a lot of strong guys that have trained at this gym, and those are the best. Yeah. And now Trayvon Dier is represented there. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Are you going to – is there any plans to take the full board? Are you going to, like, try yeah, to so get that, the bench? I think, yeah, I think that's going to be the plan now is get the bench, and then I want to go elite. And yeah, 148 because like I wasn't terribly far. So no, what's that total? Uh, 1210. He's 1180. Oh, yeah, yeah, right, so you're yeah. right there. Basically, like basically, basically if you basically you, if I would have got the squat. Yeah, if you get then I would have won the squat. You do that September meet like you're talking yeah. about. Do the squat, make the bench, take all of it, clean sweep plus elite. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. retire. Just yoke set. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then he'd be like, "Yep, I'm out." <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I told him that we'll have a jersey and we'll retire his jersey. <laughs> yeah, right, <laughs> dude. Yeah, that's so good. <laughs> yeah, it was awesome. I, I think. I just really enjoyed um, – if I if I knew how to run camera shit like you guys, I would have fucking captured it too because I fucking – I don't know how to do that. But you try? Yeah, but I mean you've done so many of that those things for me as has have Kyle over the years. It's like when you guys have moments, I want to make sure you have them. And we had Cam's mom. Cam's mom got – Marge, shout out Margie. She got everyone's video. Yeah, see, there nice. you go. Did she? <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. So at least you do have some footage yeah, yeah. because I wanted to make sure – I fucked it up the first time, but that you were wrapped good enough and that I knew it was going to be chaotic. And basically, if not, you'd have been wrapping yourself because there's no one else there. Cole wasn't able to go like the other, some of the other guys weren't able to go. So yeah. I was like, I'm at least going to drive my ass down here and make sure Trey can get this squat. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, the other guys in the meet, Fraunfelder ends up, I'm going to tell the rest of the story. So the fucking wrap falls off. And then the next one, I wrapped the shit out of him with those wraps. It's 243. 
me and Tyler are out there. He gets out of the hole and it bends him the fuck over. Mm. And he's got to question whether he's a man or not <laughs> at this point. And he grinds through it, but the crowd is cheering like crazy. So he comes out of there. He's hype. I'm like, fuck these wraps. Let me get Tyler's wraps, the white atomic yeah, ones. Yeah. And so, so he goes to 250. And I'm like, I'm going to wrap the absolute <laughs> fucking shit out of your knees right now. And I'm fucking yanking on Big Mike's knees, right? What, what was Big Mike saying while this was oh, going on? Oh, he's hyped. He's like, oh, yeah, oh, G. Yeah, oh, yeah, G. Yeah, oh, yeah, G. Yeah, G. G. Oh, yeah, G. <laughs> yeah, so, G. Yeah. <laughs> we need that Big Mike on the fucking we podcast. We fucking do. Yeah, big time. So anyway, so we go to 250 and he fucking smokes it. He's like, that's a whole different, that's a whole different ball game, G. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I fucked those other raps. I don't know what the hell Tyler Olds yeah. gave me. It was so funny. Uh, and then from Tyler, Tyler Galbraith. Well, first off, Cam ended up squatting like four and a half, which was a, a PR yeah. for him. Four, he did squat four, four, same as you, right? Yep, yep. Fifty-two. His jumps were real good, but him and Trey were so close together. Cam thought I was out there to call him. He got to the bottom yeah. on his third one, realized I wasn't there, yeah. and then finally just got up. And he, you know, his good morning shit he'll do or whatever he got up with it which was good shout out cam yeah he's got a strong back and then tyler galbraith um wrapped himself but i called him and his opener at 550 dude he hit the rebound of the spot at the same time i hit one and it looked like it was an empty bar i mean 550 opener fucking smoke jumps to 600 i called him in the right spot but he lost it a little forward and the bar must have dipped a centimeter, dude. So it like, yeah, it like it's almost like a centimeter. It's almost like he like lost it Flinch. and then regained it and they called it a dip bar and they, they red lighted it. On the third one, <clears throat> I noticed his one knee kind of comes in sometimes under heavy load. I'm like, dude, you gotta wrap your left knee a little bit tighter so you can try to like keep that position. And I hit him in the right spot, but I think his knee came in a little bit and it kind of contorts the way his hips look. Mm -hmm. I still think he hit depth. But I think I think one of the, we needed we got one one white light we needed two yeah. and I think one of the other ones just the angle messed with their brain a little bit and yeah, so yeah. but he handled six hundred both times yeah. really yeah. easy so I think for a meet that only had like forty people in it all of the guys that went looked really good and improved you know upon their numbers because Tyler went and he improved his total by two pounds but he pulled six thirty five so I mean that was or six thirty four which is, and his is that his best pull ever in the I believe so yes his other pull was uh six. 605 I think like yeah. actually in a meet so yeah. and he pulled I think uh, that was at, after the <clears throat> after the bodybuilding show I think mm, yeah so all right. anyway yeah it was pretty <laughs> sick um all right anything else about the meet Trey what else what do you think so you, do you get the competitive juices just back in general I mean you haven't done anything since you ran track yeah I mean it's been like literally like five years or something since I know I that's a long something time athletically so like yeah it was just like super like it was it was like awesome, like just to compete again mm. and all that shit. But definitely got to do it again. Is Deer hungry now? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I might as well, I might as well finish the board. I think. Yeah. <laughs> well, and I think Trey, Trey, the capturing of the longer form videos was a plus. I think, mm -hmm. like having you train. So, like, I don't think it's a detriment to the videos or to the quality of things we're putting out on the app because you jump in on the main days. So, like, I yeah. mean, as much as you want to do that, like I said, I'm good with that because. I think people like watching some of the long form stuff so they can study. Like Zach said that a lot of his clients were like, I can see how your jump, your jumps, yeah, and you can see like the every, way you're taking. Yeah. So, you know, I know they're like 20 minute videos, but I think they're more informational just cause we're showing the way we're doing them. So that might force you to train a little bit well, more and often. You, <laughs> and you can see all the different body types and heights and all that shit too. Feet with the way they're getting tight under the bar, all that stuff. Mm -hmm. yeah. So it's pretty good. Um, Cole, you got any other questions for him? Um, what was the diet like? Because I know this will piss some people off too. What was your diet <laughs> leading up versus science? science. Yeah, just, yeah, just, yeah. yeah, just real quick. What was um, it? Well, I started anabolic fasting two weeks out from the meet. Because you had to make at, weight. Because I had to make weight. Yeah, what weight were you at? <clears throat> um, Like one, like when I started, like maybe like 60 or 59 I yeah. think, or something like that. I remember you saying gotcha. that. Gotcha. Yeah. And then, yeah, so then I cut down like what is that be like 11 pounds or so mm -hmm. but yeah, relatively it, easy yeah like pretty easy yeah i remember because it was that monday you woke up and you were still like you the said mon something. the mon that monday i was 59 i think yeah and yeah. i go do you have any salt yesterday he's like yeah maybe that's the problem i actually <laughs> ate a lot of salt <laughs> <laughs> yeah i was doing like yeah i was doing anabolic fasting but i was still like cranking like like i wasn't like even like Caring about like the sodium, yeah. the sodium intake level of it. Like, I was like, probably about just eat the same thing, but just take that out. And you're probably like four pounds lighter tomorrow. Yeah, and, did, and that's yeah. exactly what happened. <laughs> yeah. 
And then like every day, he'd just tell me what he eat, and he just yeah. kept dripping down. And you made weight pretty easy. Yeah, it wasn't bad. And yeah. then now yeah. though, after the dude, after the meat, I've been eating so much. Like, Degenerate. This, yes, this yeah. whole this whole week, I've been eating like the most amount of food I think I've ever eaten. Last night, you'll love this. Please. Last night, I went and got dinner. I go, like, I went to just walked to a restaurant and sat down, and ate. And I got done eating, and I was still hungry. Mm -hmm. So and then I went and got like fast food. Then on top of it, <laughs> <Fuck> yeah, <laughs> that's the fucking super set of the week. The topper, yeah. Yeah. So I ate, like, two, ate like two dinners last night, and then right. literally, but like literally this this whole week I've been just eating. Like if I'm hungry, I just see, I just smash. Eat. Yeah, like whatever I want. There you go. Trigger the McDonald's yeah. breakfast. I know. I had Wendy's this morning. It was amazing. This fucking guy. So I had Wendy's last night, too. <laughs> <laughs> so you're thinking about doing the meet in September? Is yeah. that the, like, the next yeah, one? Yeah, September, yeah. The one at Alpha Evolution? Yeah. Or the yeah. Empire one? Yeah, I think that's the one, whatever one Tyler got. No, that's the one, Tyler Tyler that's the one right, right down the street, yeah, yeah, yeah. which will be cool for some of the guys to do, I think. Yeah, yeah. And Josh is a good dude. Shout out Josh Moore. Bring a couple guys over there. It'd be cool. Danny, you got any questions for him? I don't think so. Yeah? That's pretty much it. Trayvon. Congrats, bro. Thank you. Yeah. It's awesome yeah. to see Dier up there. That's it's awesome elite. to see you as an athlete in action. Uh, Roundtable podcast, quick little meet recap. Just holler at Trey. Tell yeah. him congrats. Yeah, tell him he's fucking Jack. Tell him he's Jack. Tell him, yeah. Tag Vogue. We'll give you his nutrition plan, too. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's called Trayvon. Yeah, yeah. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Brought to you by MaxEverMuscle.com. We're out. <laughs>